Africa Day. What is that? Africa Day is a day for um, freedom, right? Uh, but I'm not a politician, I'm a creative. Africa Day means to me creative freedom, right? What opportunities do we have as creatives in Africa? Are we just copying everyone's aesthetic? Don't we have our own? This is something that uh, we're gonna be showcasing today. We wanna be able to showcase the creative minds with the support of the King Speed crew. We're gonna take you guys through a whole production showing you everything, what it means to be a creative in Zambia. Uh, but more so a creative in Africa and show you our African aesthetic. Uh, yeah. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. To Fijian design. Right, so um, these guys pretty much need a, um, a campaign, right? Uh, they'll need to share with us things like, you know, reception designs, office designs. Hi. My name's Aspia Mercy Kateole. I am the Creative Business Development Manager here and Social Media Expert. I'm Nampito and I'm a creative. I am a free-spirited human being that really loves to do dope stuff. Yes, sir. How are you? Uh, my name is Blessing Otawa. <laughs> yeah, I'm a DOP man. I'm a Director of Photography. Hello. Okay, so my name is Job Sunduza Piri. Um, I'm a brand strategist. I'm a graphic designer as well. That's what I do. My names, uh, my names are Shalom Ndumo Zulu. I am a web developer. Uh, my name is Tembiso Kasimba. I'm a multimedia designer by day and a Photoshop artist by night. My name is Noma Temba Mwale. I am an account executive here at uh, uh, King Spirit. I basically border between um, uh, client service and uh, business development. Hello, my name is Waka Chisha and I am a photographer. Okay, so a creative business development manager, well, business development manager nonetheless, brings a new business into the company and uh, helps with marketing and strategy for the company itself and other um, companies on strategies of other companies. As social media expert, let's just say that we have a unique insight in the social media realm and creating strategies that will help you achieve your goals. The department I work in is client services. I handle all our accounts for our local and international clients. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> they're all my favorite all my clients are my favorite i love them they are my people i love you guys most days what do you think is okay um the role or the duty or the responsibility um the responsibility of uh, a dop is to photography heart of a production. Mostly we work close with the director, um, you know, discussing the feel or maybe the look of uh, the project, how the, the director envision the project and we help the director bring that to life. <laughs> so I give life to the director. Without me, he dies on set. What would you do if you found out that you have a spinal cord? If I find that I have a spinal cord, mm. I have to go and visit the, the doctor and they remove it. Well, um, yeah, I got a promotion. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> I got a promotion. Uh, so what I do um, in graphic designing, basically I build brands. I create brands as well, strategy. I, I, I do visuals as well. My work as the office manager, I make sure that things are in order and that everyone is happy and smiling. King Spirit is an advertising agency so much into videography, photography, branding and uh, digital marketing to mention but a few. We've worked with clients like um, IZB. <laughs> IZB. Get out of here right now. Indo Zambia Bank. Continue. Uh, Intercon, um, Airtel. We worked with clients like uh, Pamalat. I everything. <laughs> I think I enjoy <laughs> literally from the time I get to the gate to the time I leave home. <laughs> Are you sure? I love interacting with the creatives and seeing how they develop their concepts. I love ideas being 
brought to life, seeing that is amazing for me. I want my clients to be happy, first of all. Um, I want all my deliverables to be on time. Um, I just want to see them happy. That's what, if a happy client is a happy me. So if they're not happy, and also I want to make sure that they are making their money because when they make money, I make my money. <laughs> yeah, boy. Well, it's a freedom of expression to me. And I, I am glad that I am free to express myself in whatever form I, I feel fit. Uh, first of all, um, as a creative, to me, Africa, Africa Day, it, hey man, it means a lot. You know, it, um, it means that we as Africans, we, we are free. <laughs> <laughs> we will be, we will be dressing in our cultural attire, uh -huh. dancing as well, uh -huh. it's photography, uh -huh. I will dance a bit. Oh. <laughs> to me. In my line of work, I get to freely express myself creatively to my clients and with my clients and in the work that we give out. So having a day where we can just say, yes, I'm free, it feels good because um, it's great to always be part of a team that can think outside of the box and also just brings up really, really dope ideas into the creative space. For me, that's freedom. The fact that African, uh, the African style, the African um, the African theme is becoming more global now. It's more. It's becoming more accepted. It's becoming way more marketable. It's. 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 it's that should be already a, a pull for people, uh, for web developers to actually add the African feel to their development because it's already. It's already being. It's already standing out. The makeup was done by Ketwa, she's amazing and this is why I look so fabulous today. I think one thing, I'll, I'll give you what I tell myself in the mirror every day. As an African creative or even just being around African creatives, it's a blessing. You have the opportunity to really rewrite history to impact millions and let them know that this is what you are a voice, really. And I feel like, do not compare yourselves, rather uh, focus on your strengths, focus on what you're good at, focus on telling your story the way you can without the outside influence. Be inspired, yes, but then don't uh, remove the authenticity in your voice. I think that's important to me. And most of all, if they can do it, you can do it. They meaning everyone else. <laughs> Yes, I do. I do a lot. Mostly I look at uh, African content because I want to see what's trending and I don't want to be very much off um, what's happening locally and everything. So I look at international and local and then I combine them.
African uh, photographers. I I love Osborne Makaria's work. He's got these um, Afrofuturistic themes that I relate to in my work too. So I, I really love his work. Internationally, I follow um, Brooke Shaden and Bella Kotak. These are people that I've followed for a very long time and I think I've learned quite a lot from them as well. Also because they're female photographers. Well, I enjoyed working at King Spirit because um, it's just full of creatives and uh, ideas just flow in and out and then it's easy to learn uh, things when you're working together with uh, fellow artists and uh, creatives. Um, mostly uh, teamwork and um, just how to solve certain problems because most of the time I used to just run away from problems. Why are you running? And then uh, maybe if I fail to create something and then I just be like, oh, no, I know I can't do this. How did you find me? But then at King Spirit, I learned how to tackle those challenges and uh, solve them with me within the time given. Yeah, uh, okay, I always like to say that I'm a, a, a natural born leader. Wherever I'm placed, wherever I find myself, I, I find myself taking on um, leadership roles. So with that, even as we're leading our clients into like uh, futuristic uh, ideas and all of that, I see myself leading uh, them, being at the center of leading them in that direction. And at King Spirit, yeah, watch out. Yeah, I'm about to see a boss babe just climb up these ladders. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Asking for your brother, are you single? Mm, guys! <laughs> if you are single, Who's where, asking? Where, where are you found? No, you it single? depends. Who's asking? asking <laughs> it depends who's asking. So you want me to slap you because... Yeah, prove to me that you don't love me. Way back it was not like this. You know, we didn't have the freedom that we have today you know, as creatives of Africa, you know, but today, you know, because of um, this Freedom Day, you know, uh, man, we are here, you know, we are doing our thing, you know, we are showcasing our work, you know, and that really, yeah, makes me, makes me proud. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> anniversary so yeah i am going to pamper you i said pamper you pamper you like this and my birthday is tomorrow so oh, <laughs> so friends hello <laughs> my mom my mom i love you <laughs> my <laughs> Uh, okay, I love everybody. Yeah, so yeah, it's wild. My girlfriend. Yes. <laughs> What's her name? What's her name? What's your girlfriend's name? What's your girlfriend's name? What's your girlfriend's name? Cut that. Good. Leave me. If there is another word, I don't know. But yeah, I love, I love my work. I love my work. Um, I love my work so much. Is this still an interview or what? <laughs> the only video that's circulating is of me crying at my wedding and that's I that's ish. that's really I feel like I'm being terrorized. But yeah, I didn't say much, yes sir. Um uh you know they were my in-laws and other people so I had to be humble. Yes sir. We want to find you crying.
Ah, okay, me, I'm done with the interview, man. Ah, booty. Ah, no, I'm done, sir. I'm done. Ah, I'm done. Jimmy. Just wanna say hello to my cat. What? Hello to my cat. <laughs> Look, you won't see this video, but I'll show you. Yeah, no, I wanna say hi to my haters. Shout out to my haters. <laughs> yeah. First of all, mom, dad, thank you for sponsoring most of, like, almost all my life when it comes to education, uh, my undergraduate, my postgraduate. Thanks for everything. I would not be the person I am today if it wasn't for the, uh, the, the, the mentorship and the love and the attention that you've been giving me throughout my life. I'm actually glad that you're still alive. My older sister, I love you and thanks for the support as well. You are one of the biggest reasons to why I am the way I am. And my cousins, my other mother, <laughs> Um, I'm Sarah, uh, my uncle, Uncle Liche. One hour later. My brothers, Loti, uh, Wongani. A few moments later. Yeah, I have a, like, uh, Priscovia. Two thousand years later. If you know Priscovia, you know why I'm saying hi. What is that? I don't understand. What is that? Huh? Love you. Shout out to all my friends. And my family, I love you guys so much. Mama, I made it. Um, I just want to say hi to my family, my friends, everybody who believes in me, and everybody who supports me in my work. Um, thank you, and happy Africa Day. <laughs>